Hello, this is Manesh Patel from the EIA Capital Group. Uh, today's video we're going to be discussing Ichimoku Kinko Ohio. Um, this is going to be the first of probably six or seven different videos that we're going to be releasing on YouTube uh, where each video is going to give you a breakdown of Ichimoku Kinko Ohio. The complete video series on YouTube will give you a complete picture of, of how someone you could use Ichimoku to trade any instrument out there, any time frame that you want, and any market condition that's, uh, that's also present. Okay. Um, so what is Ichimoku Kinko Ohio? Let me go through, and before we start going through that, let's go through the normal disclaimer. Uh, you can go through it, but basically uh, all these videos are for educational purpose only. And also, just to note, all the charts are basically in Thinkorswim platform. You could go to www.thinkorswim.com and you could check out their charting platform or their brokerage services that they offer. Now, we're going to go for a couple of minutes just to go through the history of Ichimoku Kink, Ohio, but we're not going to go for it in great detail. The only reason why we're bringing this up is to show that this is an established system. Not a lot of people have heard of it here in the Western world. And the reason why is it's been a lot of the books and everything have been written in Japanese. And just recently, in the last couple of years, there's been a Western push for Ichimoku to be, uh, you know, used in trading everything from forex to currencies, for, uh, to futures, to equities, and so forth. Um, the key thing to note here, uh, there's three systems actually used in the Japanese trading rooms. The very first one you're probably very familiar with, which is Japanese candlesticks. Most people have heard of dojis and so forth. The second system is Japanese Renko and Kaji charts. And then the third one is actually Ichimoku Kinko Ohio. Okay. Now, just here's my contact details. Uh, you're more than welcome to email me. Uh, also, we'll show you at, towards the end of the presentation. Uh, the website which has a whole bunch of resources that are available for free for the trader to learn Ichimoku Kink Ohio. Um, so we're just going to start jumping into the charts and that way you can start seeing everything that's out there. Uh, the chart here is a 120 minute each, uh, chart of the E-mini S&P 500 futures and you could see that this is the Ichimoku system. Now, the Ichimoku system, as you can see, is very, very easy to use. The reason why is it's a pure visual based system. Uh, it's very it's visual oriented with this cloud. Most people call this uh, cloud trading. Uh, that's another name for Ichimoku. Um, but, you know, and, the re and you could see why. Okay. Uh, if you look at the Ichimoku system, it basically consists of five main indicators. Okay. The very first indicator you have is this red line. We call it the Tinkinson. Now, this is basically the formula is based on nine periods. So this represents short-term price action. The next indicator we have is the Cajunson, which is this green line. This represents medium-term price action. The reason why is it represents 20 period, 26 periods of price action. The third indicator you have is this purple line, and if you notice, it's shifted back in time. Okay, so if you look at today and you look at the current price right now and you shift that back 26 periods, that's basically what the value of the Chicago indicator is. And the reason why is what you want to do is with the Chicago is you're kind of looking at current price action and then you're going to compare it to price action from 26 periods ago. And based on that, you're going to see if the current uh, price, act price is in a trend or not in a trend. Uh, which is basically in a consolidation period. The Chicago you're going to find to be very valuable because that is your momentum indicator. It's going to basically determine if you're going to get into a long-term trend, medium trend, short-term, or so forth. Okay, A lot of people unfortunately ignore the Chicago indicator, but we're not. There's going to be a video dedicated series specifically for the Chicago indicator. Okay. The next two indicators that we're going to go for basically consist of uh, making up this Kumo cloud. The white line is the short term. It's called Senecao A, and it basically consists of taking the Tinkinson, which is nine periods, and averaging it out with the Cajunson, which is 26 periods. So that roughly gives you a price action of about 14 periods. And then the Senecao B is here, which is a yellow line that makes up the bottom of this cloud basically consists of 52 periods, so price action for 52 periods. 
Okay, together, as I mentioned, this basically forms the Kumo cloud. Now, there's two parts of Kumo cloud that which we'll get into the video, uh, the individual video on the Kumo cloud in great detail. When you're looking at price, this basically is the current Kumo cloud, and this is the future Kumo cloud right there. Both of those are key in determining exactly whether you should trade or not to trade, and we'll go for those in great detail once we get into the individual video on the Kumo cloud. Okay, now we're going to go to the website and we're going to show you some of the things on the website. This is eiicapital.com. And if you go here, you see the headers here. This takes you to individual websites where we have different resources that are available for each of Group specifically. You have the blog, this is where I go through, uh, look at futures, equity, stocks, everything out there, and actually put live trades out there for educational purpose only where people could see how to enter uh, with trade entries, uh, how to use Ichimoku for trade uh, management, for risk management, and so forth. Also, there's a form there for uh, open discussion where people could ask any question on Ichimoku. You could post charts for feedback. Uh, you could ask any questions in regards to GAN, Fibonacci, and all that, too. Uh, then you have the wiki, which goes through all the definitions of Ichimoku, talks about all the strategies for Ichimoku and everything out there. And then the fourth, the fifth one is probably the most valuable. A lot of people are going there now. Is if you go to the download section, you could actually sit there and uh, request for our free uh, webinar that we did uh, a while back ago, where it's about two to three hours of where we go for a full-blown presentation in Jimuku, and the audience actually goes through some Q and A and asks their questions. Okay. Um, so as I mentioned, we're going to be going through. Uh, YouTube and releasing about six or seven videos through here you can download a full-blown video archive of all of Ichimoku so you don't have to go for all those two, six or seven if you want and just go for the entire uh, uh, archive and learn Ichimoku that way or you could go for the six or seven videos on YouTube um, also if you scroll down there's gonna be a lot of little videos that we're offering uh, here uh, where we're going to be showing a lot of different things. One here is like back testing with Ichimoku with Thinkorswim. Uh, second is show how to set up the indicator for Thinkorswim uh, and so forth. There's also going to be other videos we're going, to, we're going to be releasing for other brokerage firms. But So these are quick little tutorials. And they're about 15, 20, 30 minutes long on how to do various things out there. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, I do have a book coming out. Uh, it's called Trading with Ichimoku Clouds. Um, if you go to Amazon, you could get more information in regards to the book, uh, but it should be being released around June 6th of this year, 2010. Um, that's about it for right now. Uh, if you have any questions, here's my contact details. But I look forward to hearing from people and helping you guys learn more about Ichimoku.